Here's a live look at Boston Common this noon time, where we could soon be seeing some big changes. Leaders in Boston have a new vision for America's first public park. And they also want input from people who live in the city. WBZ's Katrina Kincaid shows us what could be in the works. They're hoping to start all of these projects in the start of the next fiscal year, although they did tell us that they're not sure how much all these projects are going to cost. They say an upwards of $100 million, and right now they have a little over $20 million from the sale of a local garage to start. Boston Common is truly a place that is meant to bring us together, that shifted the way this country thought about who would benefit from green spaces and open lands. This plan has been in the works since 2019, but was delayed by the pandemic. They used over 10,000 public responses to hear from people what projects they want to see in the park. And one of the key changes people asked for, much needed public restrooms. And we're looking at it in several places in the common, not just one. So we know it's amenity people need. Visitors of the park will also eventually see an expanded visitor center, a new splash pad, an accessible play area, and enclosed dog park, more seating, and improved infrastructure for events and performances. Seven million people a year come to this park. The infrastructure is tired. One big change that visitors would notice is that they're planning on relocating these tennis courts and putting in basketball courts in the area. Through these recommendations outlined in this plan, the park's natural, historic, cultural, and visual character will be strengthened and preserved for both today's users and future generations. Now they're asking you, the public, to weigh in again. There's now a 45-day public comment period where the city wants to hear which of the projects people think should be a priority. In Boston, Katrina Kincaid, WBZ News.